I'm only doing my job. Some people are bull fighters, some people are politicians. I'm a photographer. You are watching Visual Independence. With the introduction of the first consumer digital cameras in the late 1980s, photography underwent a paradigm shift. Moving from analog, depending on chemically produced light-sensitive emulsions, to a medium using digital technologies for image capturing and storage. The almost infinite flexibility to digitally manipulate images was used as a creative tool by numerous visual artists early on. This revived the legacy of photo collage, duplicate printing, and various other kinds of existing analog manipulation. The popularity of image editing programs that also enabled animation, motion control, and audio editing created a dynamic environment in which photography became a tool for creating multimedia experiences. While visual artists were generally excited by the possibilities of digital imaging, many photojournalists and documentary filmmakers reacted with skepticism. The unlimited influence of digital photography on commercial imagery only became noticeable in the first decade of the new century. Towards the end of the decade, virtually all newspapers and magazines had adapted to a digital workflow. In journalism, digital cameras became the standard due to the fact that they could be transferred and processed immediately. Digital photography was now largely integrated into the realm of modern art, commercial photography and online digital communication. As a result, it was losing its once independent character, yet the impact of photography as a visual medium became increasingly significant. There's no doubt that digital photography has dramatically changed the way people take and share photos. The snapping to the sharing of the image happens in real time. The auto portrait, which already played an important role in the analog vernacular, and in the art photography of the 1980s, has taken on unimagined proportions in the digital age, creating a new term that is accepted and understood worldwide. The selfie. The digital revolution has permanently revamped self-expression, staging, the use of metaphors, and aesthetics. Since 2007, the year Apple launched its first iPhone, smartphones and image sharing apps have enabled users to post images online instantly from their devices. By doing so, they are seeking to compete in a visual-based culture which is dominated by the like button. In today's media-based digital culture, the industrial feat of processing millions of photographs has largely supplanted the complex achievement of examining a singular photograph. However, this condition has in turn created space for the arrival of new photo enthusiasts. Parallel to the digital transformation, new, young generation of photographers are discovering analog film photography for themselves. Professional photo labs are seeing an increase in new customers who are enthusiastic about traditional film processing. In addition, many photo professionals have never given up on traditional photography. At no time was analog photography threatened with extinction, it has merely gained a cult status. Both analog and digital photography play an important role in documenting the world. Together, they help us understand our surroundings, ourselves, and others.